so welcome to a video where I'm going to talk about the decline of Lil Tay. Um, I haven't made a video about her because I'm not really one for making videos based on, I suppose, popular culture. Um, I might start doing so, uh, but the only reason I'm making this is because since her interview of Good Morning America, uh, more has happened. Uh, I want to start by showing uh, this. That is her, uh, the Instagram. As you can see, there's zero posts. And what happened there was she deleted every post on, on Instagram and the profile picture is currently white, so she just kind of cleared it. It's maybe as a result of the Good Morning America interview. I don't think there's really any information about as to why. Let's talk about how this came to be, what led up to it and such. So Lil Tay was known for, or is or was, I'm not sure, uh, known for making videos of her flexing uh, about like all these fancy houses and these fancy cars and stuff and throwing like money kind of at the camera and whatnot and being like, oh, I have this, you know, what are you doing with your life kind of thing. Then it was found out that her mother uh actually got fired as a result and that was because the cars belonged to her boss and the houses she was a real estate agent and the houses the fancy houses um weren't actually hers she was a real estate agent i guess since her mum got fired things have been on the decline and Essentially, it's come out and it's now known that uh, Lil Tay was a character, um, but the bad part of that is that it almost seems as if she was partially being used. Uh, and the reason why I say partially is because uh, there is video of her brother, uh, like, telling her what to do for videos and stuff and then getting a bit cross when she doesn't like say the exact thing or whatever yet she came out out of character uh and said that she was doing what she wanted to make her mum proud so I'm not sure uh where the line between uh her doing what she wanted and her being pushed to do this actually is uh, which is a bit sad, but I guess that's just how it is. And maybe if she like comes back and does more or something, if she's actually herself even, then we might find out more behind that. Uh, she also released a song, which isn't too bad. But next I want to talk about the Good Morning America interview and why that was such a shock or whatever. So Lil Tay did an interview on Good Morning America. And parents say it was a good interview. I saw bits and pieces of it from, I think, a PewDiePie video. And the interview was well done. But the thing was that, where was this loud mouth nine-year-old? Wasn't anywhere. She was out of character, or she was, sorry, she was herself in this interview. And it's really interesting, and it's kind of, Good to show that she is actually human and normal but unfortunately there's still going to be people who see her on the street and are like oh hey Lil Tay uh, do such and such or say such and such like there's lots of famous actors and stuff who have famous catchphrases and stuff and whenever they get seen in the street they're like oh hey say such and such um, so Unfortunately, that is the position that she's placed in. Um, but hopefully, now with what's come out and stuff, she finds kind of more of her own identity. And given how Lil Tay went, I would like to think that she has a platform to do what she wants and she could be her actual self and make her mum proud like she wants to. So 
hopefully, maybe she might ditch Lil Tay for now, if not forever, and then just be herself and she can gather fame from that, then good. There'll be no acting or anything. Mind you, a lot of people thought it was real, so it must have been, must have been good acting. Might see her in, uh, in a movie sometime if she's that good acting. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed the video, don't forget to leave a like. Uh, if you're new here, don't forget to hit the subscribe button and turn on notifications if you want to see my videos first. Uh, and also comment uh, video suggestions if you have any. Um, and let me know if you want me to cover more pop culture kind of stuff. Um, at the moment, I'm just doing kind of random stuff because I feel like it, basically. Um, but yeah, thanks for watching, and I'll see you soon for more content. <laughs>